Christopher, Ben from Hey You Guys. Hi there. Good to meet you, sir. And you. Now, I understand you're in charge of the special effects on the film. Yes, I am, yeah. So, I mean, working with someone like Chris Nolan, uh, you'll forgive me, there are lots of Chris's that I'm going to be talking to tonight. But working with someone like Chris Nolan, who clearly likes the practical side, is that a change and a bit of a relief from having your work stolen by the VFX guys? <laughs> oh, that's unfair. That's unfair on the VFX guys. Um, no, Chris loves doing stuff for real, and it, it, I think it, it also goes hand in hand with my stuff on the Bond films as well. But you know, it's the fourth film I've done with Chris now, and uh, he sets great challenges, uh, and it has a brilliant mind. So, constantly exploring what we can do, which is, you know, I can't ask for any more than that. And how much of a crossover is there for you between sort of your side and the VFX side to achieve what we see on screen realistically? There's a real marriage between us and the visual effects. You know, we, we, you know, we built this flying thing and flung it around Los Angeles and Pittsburgh and New York. But the visual effects guys did a wonderful job. You know, enhancing what we did and painting out things. You know, they, they are, they, they, they deserve some a huge amount of credit on this film. So, and what was the sort of what are you happiest to have had the chance to build for this movie? I think the bat, really. It was um, when I heard it was going to be the bat in the film. I thought it would be all be CGI. So the fact that we got a chance to shoot so much of it for real, and you know, we had it hanging under the helicopters, flying it around LA, charging through the streets at 60, 70 mile an hour on trucks. It was. Uh, it, it became a real mission in the end to see how much we could actually get with it. So it was great. And it's all full scale. It's not particularly model work, or. No, it's it's all full full scale. It's a bit of a monster. It's nearly 30 foot long by 17 foot wide by 12 foot high. It's uh, a bit bigger than his normal bit of kit. Nice. Not going to get that in there then. No, no, you wouldn't get there. No, we're down there. That's for sure. <laughs> Thank you very much, Chris. My pleasure. My pleasure.